Good day, grade 4 little scientists. I'm Teacher V, your scientific buddy. Are you ready to learn? Let's go! For this week's lesson, Quarter 3, Week 1, Effects of Force on Objects, Part 1. We will explain the effects of force when applied to an object. Force is a push or pull which occurs when two or more objects interact with each other. The shape of an object may change when force is applied on it. What are the forces that we can apply to change the shape of a given material? These are the forces that we can apply to change the shape of a material. Pressing Twisting Bending Pounding Crumbling Compressing Stretching And squeezing Let's have an activity! Choose the force or forces that you can apply to change the shape of the given materials. You have one minute to answer this. Your time starts now! Time's up! Take a look at the answers. If you got 3 to 5, you can continue. But if you got 3 below, you need to go back from where we started. When force is applied to an object, the size of an object may change. What are the forces that we can apply to change the size of a given material? These are the forces that we can apply to change the size of materials. Dropping Sharpening Grinding Pounding Cutting and tearing. Let's have another activity. Choose the force or forces that you can apply to change the size of the given material. You have one minute to answer this. Your time starts now.
times up. Take a look at the answers. If you got 3 to 5, you can continue. But if you got 2 and below, you can go back or you need to go back to our previous lesson. When force is applied to an object, the movement of an object may change. Push. A force to move something away from you. In push and go, if you apply an equal amount of force to two objects of different masses, for example, 10 kilograms and 20 kilograms, with 10 newton force both, the object with less mass will accelerate more. If you apply different amounts of forces to objects with the same mass, for example, 10 newton and 3 newton for the same mass of 10 kilograms, the object that has more force applied to it will accelerate faster. These are examples of push or pushing. Pull, a force to move something towards you. These are examples of pull or pulling. Let's have our last activity. Below are some pictures of pushing and pulling forces. Describe the pictures. Right push or pull. You have one minute to answer this. Your time starts now. Time's up! Take a look at the answers. If you got 3 to 5, congratulations! But if you got 2 and below, you need to rewatch our video lesson. Wow! We're done with our lesson! Congratulations! See you next video!